to create content or posts on our website we simply come over here to the post section and we say add new posts and this is one of the most interesting section here we can add a header or a title for our post add the title of the post okay and here i can start writing my content i can come over here and i copy this content right here it's dummy content basically come over here add the content and within this content you can add a couple of uh, details for example i can say i want to add an image right here so i can come over here and then i add an image block i can upload that image by coming over here to my images area I can simply add an image right there and I can also choose the image size I want it to be medium full size or whatever I can even reduce it from right here just by doing that you can even add an image caption and uh, a lot more you can even add you can interlink different uh, uh, content on your website for example by highlighting the content that you want to interlink and come over here and you can add a link to a specific piece of content on the internet or anywhere within your website we can even bold for example you can say we want to highlight this piece something like that or even uh, italicize the other thing we can add a featured image of our blog post for example by coming here to document i can come here to featured image select a featured image and i can upload a featured image of our blog content right there so maybe this one is our featured image i can add it over there by simply uploading the featured image and i can add an alternative text this is the text that appears once the image doesn't show up so i can simply just get over here the name of the image i paste it over there and then i set the featured image of our blog post now the featured image is this kind of image right here when i come to my blog come to reviews you realize that i have this is a featured image it appears before you actually read the blog or this one here or this one here or this one here okay so all those are featured images uh, the other thing is categories now this is very important for a news website so where do you want to categorize this piece of content now in this case i want to put this under business but i can also put it under sports so business may be like my main category and then it can also be in the news now that means it will appear in it will appear in both the news category and also the business category then the other thing you can add is also the excerpt this is like a summary of your uh, blog post come to document and right here you can add your excerpt the discussion section allows you to add to allow comments on this specific blog post or not so i'll now deactivate the ping box and the track box and then the post attributes you can choose here the kind of the type of layout that you want to use now in this case we won't enable anything right here because we are not going to use the astra theme settings we are basically using it as our base for our blog now once you are done writing your blog post content you can simply hit publish publish now this means that our blog post will be published live on our website i have a complete tutorial on how to write delete publish or even edit content on wordpress blogs and i'm going to link it up right here in the card or in the description box below so in case you want to learn more about how you can make edits in this kind of blog post add images add videos add tweets and a couple of more interesting stylings you can simply check out that blog right up here or in the description box below now i'm going to add a couple of other posts and i'll come back later when i'm when i am done So at the moment i've created about nine blog posts on our website this is the list when you come over under all posts you see them all listed right here 
and when you go to our website homepage this is how they look like at the moment